In Boston, we realize that if we want to be a city of opportunity, we can't leave anyone behind. Uh, that's vitally important for us as we move forward here. And we can't, can't waste anyone's talents. Uh, that's why we decided to, to do things a little differently in our city. We started asking young people who had dropped out of school what they wanted to and, and how they wanted to potentially get their education in another way. It's thanks to the expertise and dedication of leaders like you and coalitions like the Boston Opportunity Youth Collaborative. In the end, it comes down to one thing, letting young people know in authentic ways that they belong, that, they, their, that their future is important and that their future is our future. It's not just them and it's, it's all of us together and we have to continue to do that. One of the things that I will say about Boston is it's a city where it's about three degrees of separation and not six degrees of separation. And so that may be one of the secret components here. Uh, there are people who don't work with each other, but they actually know each other. It's just an unproductive relationship. We can change that. <laughs> Here, the 100% graduation, that is our goal. We hear that as the goal for most school systems. Well, I could get 100% graduation in Boston Public Schools if I lower the graduation requirement to such a low level that every kid graduates. But that doesn't solve any problems. I really think that the, our North Star needs to be guided differently. It needs to be about both college, it has to be about career, and it actually has to be about life.